Hello everyone. In this video I'm going to look at how to find the solution to tangent of theta equals negative 1, or I should say how to find all solutions. And all is very important. That tells us that we want all possible solutions as we go to infinity. For a problem like this, we want to first of all consider where is our tan where is tangent defined as negative? We want to make sure we're in the proper quadrants because we're looking for angle or, more specifically, radian measures. So tangent is negative in quadrants 2 and 4 because it's positive in quadrants 1 and 3. We also want to understand that our period of tangent is pi. That will help us identify all possible solutions. So we want to know where is tangent negative 1, or in general, this will allow us to no ignore the negative for now, where is tangent equal to positive, or just to 1? For this, we want to use our two main triangles, either our 30, 60, 90, or our 45, 45 right. Now, our 30, 60, 90 has no way of getting 1 when you take tangent of any angle. But our 45, 45 right does. If I were to place theta right here, tangent of that would be 1 over 1, which is what I want. So by using our 45, 45 right, we can assume then that the angle measure we're considering is pi over 4, or some iteration of that. Now we have to consider, in quadrants 2 and quadrants 4, what are the equivalent uh, radi radian measures? Using pi over 4 as a reference angle, the angle here would be 3 pi over 4. Likewise, the angle here would be 7 pi over 4. Now that's within one full rotation. Now if we want to consider multiple rotations, for example, if we were to go one full rotation beyond, or one full series, using our period, I should say, we would add pi, or in this case, the equivalent of 4 pi over 4, and our new set would be 7 pi over 4 and 11 pi over 4. And I could add another period to get another set of solutions and so on and so forth. Obviously I don't want to write them all out, so a way of generally expressing that is since my period is pi, every iteration of that yields me new solutions. So for each one within my first rotation, my first re first uh, revolution, I'll say 3 pi over 4, then I'll add pi from the period, and then my constant k. k could be any integer. That tells us that tells us that this will count for all all iterations of 3 pi over 4 of that angle. And likewise, we'll do the same thing for 7 pi over 4. I'll add pi over pi k. That accounts for all iterations of the solution of 7 pi over 4. And again, since I'm asking for all solutions, these would be my answers. So again, I want to identify what angle tangent of theta equals 1 is using my 30, 60, 90, or my 45, 45, right? Within one re revolution, determine these solutions, and then use a period to express the infinite number of possibilities.